Jack Parsons got me on the moon. Jack Parsons got me on the moon. How is again? This is a question I get asked a lot, and I don't really talk about it that much because it hasn't really affected me other than superficially but why are so many new age women evil vindictive vicious and just basically miserable it's just seems now of course you know this is not all of them there's lots of new age women out there who are just lovely people but a huge percentage of them are just the dregs of humanity and uh, you know uh, the uh, the reason for that, and they're so full of hate on this, and their their ideas of superficial spirituality is completely superficial. It compensates for the fact that many of them don't have any souls as such. And the reason why so many of them are actually pathological and vicious is because of things like well, recce. Recce pra- is 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 like recce is to is like the sort of spiritual dildo of the new age. And how Reiki works is, they call upon spirits to heal. Now, and they, they, they automatically assume that these spirits are angels. They're always demons. It's the same. It's the same bunch of uh, low-level entities who show up during when you open up a Ouija board. The same ones. And event, in, in no time, these women are possessed permanently for life. And they're, there's just no hope really. And they. Uh, they become increasingly vicious and pathological and hateful, very vindictive and jealous. And often these kinds of women live in the same building because they don't have men. Men want nothing to do with them because they have a long history of every, all their exes being narcissists or psychopaths or sociopaths. They have the, That's all their exes. And so that's mainly because the exes just saw it, got sick of their shit. And what happens is, as each man they gain, well, they, the next man is a step down from the previous one, from the previous one, because by the time they're on their fourth or fifth narc, they only have the dre- the dregs of humanity in, me- in terms of men as partners, and then they even even those guys leave eventually, and it's because they they think that they have a spiritual identity that makes them better than others, and. They somehow believe that they are involved in, in, in beings of light and they're somehow, you know, light warriors for the future and this kind of thing. It's basically the same mind virus you get in born again Christianity. The same kind of people who think they're, um, you know, they've been saved and they're going to heaven and you're not. Well, the, the ones in the New Age who, you know, they're, they're so. They, 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 you know, they, they call themselves life, light workers as they're basically everyone around them hates them. And this is, you see it all the time. And uh, they're some of the most appalling and horrible human beings you'll ever meet in your life. And that's basically it. I mean, there's, there's, that's the, the recce plays a huge part in it. But there's also the ones who will be brought into it. They're trying to make out they're better than you, just like the same ones that become born again Christians. Now again, there's lots of there's lots of wonderful new women in the new age, right? But what they don't understand is they don't have a fundamental decent education on the occult or on magic or anything, and they 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 just don't, and therefore they're very susceptible when they start talking about calling spirits and working with spirits and all this stuff. That it's the same thing as a teenager with a, a, a Ouija board. The same entities will infect them. And one of the re- the, the recce thing is rec. I mean, I know there's decent people out there have done recce, but I, I have a, a very low opinion of recce. I'll tell you why. The entities deliberately get into these recce masters in order to feed off the suffering of people. So you know, you have someone who might have a horrific, a really bad fibroid, right? And it's 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 impacting upon their spinal column. Well, the recce master goes out, and this person is screaming in agony while they're while they're doing all the recce stuff around them, you know. And what they're doing is the entity inside the new ager, new age woman is uh, it can be a man, but it's usually a woman is feeding off the suffering of the person while telling them at the same time, you must have holistic medicine. Don't go to doctors. Don't go for surgery. Don't do this. They they'll kill you. They're, 
it, it's all evil all mainstream medicine is evil and i'm working spirits i'm calling on spirits to work through me to heal you and the people never get healed ever and if there's any cases he say of healing it's usually psychosomatic or a friend that had a toothache and they put a they you know they they they, they, they give them a statement on their website but that's what that is the reke is demons inside these new age women who are preying on the suffering of people and harvesting the suffering for the entity inside them and that's why i mean that's why they are the way they are i mean it's as simple as that to the point where their skulls are just like warrant with demons who are just running around inside them looking for the next sick and desperate person with cancer, stage four cancer they can take advantage of and so when you do things like that it's it's pure evil it's just pure evil and uh so you know and they still will talk about they're all about love and light and giving light and all this stuff but but they're just basically they're basically vessels for low level entities and psychic parasites to prey on the suffering of humans so they're basically just you know vehicles for vehicles for the damned that's really what they are Jack Parsons got me on the moon Jack Parsons got me on the moon